welcome back. Today I'm going to be building the Fox Lodge from the LEGO Minecraft January 2022 wave, but it's in Minecraft and not LEGO. Let's get right into it. Okay, I'm not going to be building this one-to-one -one scale from the Fox Lodge, but I'm going to be building it like, like player size, so it's not going to be too big. So yeah, if I start with that wall, I'm going to go up by three, and then I can just go like that, so that looks player sized. Alright. And then I'm going to have to build this part. And there's orange carpet on top. Okay, that's not bad. Now I'm gonna build the eyes. Hmm, how am I gonna do this? Okay, I'm not gonna build the eyes right now. I'm gonna build this part so that I can go like that. Oh, yeah, like that. That looks okay. No, it doesn't. I'll do them black and white. Alright, what are we doing now? Okay. And like that. That looks good. I think that will work. Then you can fill in this part on the head. And how does the other side look? It's just filled in. Awesome. This is the fox. I'm just gonna build the ears. For the ears. The ears can be bigger so it looks even cuter. Using jungle planks as the things inside. That looks that looks actually surprisingly good for what I'm trying to do. Alright, now I'm gonna have to find a green kind of looks like what I'm trying to use. So, I'm not sure what green I could use. I think it has to be grass from the spruce biome. So, I'm just going to use normal grass. Oh, that actually kind of works out. Doesn't look like plains grass. Actually, should have done this in spruce biome, probably. That would be a better idea. Alright, and then we have a bit of snow. Goes snow, snow, like that. And then this stuff is a bit more up, so you can do that. And I have to do a bit of water, which actually I can just use blue wool for. So it's... Like that. And then there's... Some more snow here. And there's also a bit of snow like that. Mm. 
There's a barrel. So I'll have a barrel. And I'll put, put some salmon. Fishing rod. And some cod. Salmon, a cod, and that's the barrel. Attention to detail, that's what's important. Alright, and then there's a bit of snow over here. And then there's a stone block, non infested stone, regular stone, right here, and then there's a torch on it. Gonna, I'm gonna try using this debug stick because I was testing things out with it. Okay. Mm, that doesn't work. Okay, I'll just have to have it how it is. Just have a half torch here with no snow. Saggy. And then there's a berry bush here. So I'll get some berries there. <clears throat> hmm. And then this is the outside finished. Actually, I should probably use some bone meal on this first. And then even though there's no bone meal used here, I'm just gonna get a bit of a tiny bit of grass. A bit of extra detail. Alright, that looks pretty good. Alright, now let's move on to the interior. And then I'm gonna do my own part to this. Alright, so in the interior, this is all the space we have to work with. It's actually a lot more in than in the actual build. Alright, first we have actually I'm gonna do that so it looks first I'm gonna some orange like that. And that looks like Looks like the actual thing a bit more. Alright, so first up, there's a purple bed right in the corner there. Actually, I'm just going to clean it in there. Really. So, yeah, there's a, there's a purple bed right in the corner. And then on the wall, there's an item frame. Right? Is it? Yes, right here. And that's right there. There's a furnace, crafting table, cake, stone, potted plant. I think I'll. Can you put a rose bush in it? I have no idea. No, oh, you can't. I'll use a cactus because that would. It. Because that's what it looks most like in the build. There. Yeah, that's pretty accurate. Alright. And we have cake. And the furnace right beside it. And the crafting tables there. And then we have a map. So I'll just fly over my world here and I'll get a I'll get a Okay, that actually doesn't look bad. All 
right? So then we can place this map of my world so far. But yeah, other than that, this is this interior is mostly finished. Except I'm gonna add some wool into the bottom. I'm gonna just add some wool to the bottom instead of using the dirt because I think it looks nicer if it's carpet. And then for my own custom part that I'm adding, I'm going to add a back. And then I'm also going to add a door, Casey door, going from the back. So this isn't actually in the set, this is just my own part that I'm adding. Oh yeah, um, there's no torches in this set either, except for that one outside. So, torch there, torch there. So no mobs spawn in my beautiful house. Oh, that didn't work. Hmm. There. Now we have our house. We fill in the roof. We can sleep in our new house. Hopefully. Awesome. Yeah, I wasn't sure if we'd end up outside or not. It happened to me a few times. But <clears throat> all right. now all we need to do is extend this around. Extend the outside around. Like this. Add the last bit of detailing. Have it go to here, and then I'm gonna use grass. This extra bit is just mostly so it doesn't look so plain, because Lego set is made for playability, so it's meant for you to not be able to go around the back and just see, like, just see the back, you have to be able to actually play with it. So, how's Lego would be Lego? So, oh, this is the villager's house now. Okay. No. Yeah, this is a pretty nice interior. And for the exterior, Almost finished. I'm just gonna add the rose, a couple roses for extra decoration. Then I'm gonna add a tiny bit of grass, not too much though. Don't want it to look too much. And I think I think we're done. This looks pretty good.